Are you having trouble with your brows? Drawing them on? This is the video for you. Let's do them together. Now, first of all, when you're doing brows, you have to remember that brows are sisters. They're not twins. So they're not always going to look exactly alike. So I'm just going to start with a mascara brush and we're going to get close so you can see. My eyebrows are really light and they're a lot thinner. Um, so what I'm doing is brushing them up. Gonna brush all the hairs up. I'm gonna brush them over. If you're a beginner, let's start with playing connect the dots. Now, when I first started, I did a stencil. And with the stencil, you just kind of place the stencil on your eyebrow and you kind of fill it, shade it in, and it'll give it that shape of whatever the stencil is. The easiest way you're gonna do your eyebrows is to play connect the dots. So you're gonna make a dot on the outer corner of your eyebrow in the arc and at the inner corner of your eyebrow, okay? You're gonna follow that same line at the top. Even if you have to do the same method at the top, going to continue to play connect the dots. So inner corner at the arch and outer corner of your eyebrow, of your eye. So you're going to lightly connect your dots with your pencil. You can use a light brown pencil if your eyebrows are lighter. I usually like to use black because I'm going to define it in a different way. Um, you can also use eyeshadow, which will go into that as well. So what I'm doing is kind of filling in the brows. This is how I look right now. So I'm going to now brush the product forward and brush it back to blend in the product. Don't worry about your dots. They're going to go away when you put on your concealer. There's that. Don't let that get that. All right. <clears throat> okay. I dab some of that lighter concealer off. I'm going to use this concealer just a little closer to my skin tone. Use my brush and blend it out. Now you're gonna use a concealer to more so shape your brows. So that is what the concealer is good for up under your brows. And then you're going to blend out any harsh lines and kind of blend your brows well, blend the concealer out so that it can match your eyelid. There's the bottom. I'm going to do the same thing at the top. You see how that concealer just shapes the brow? I'm going to do the same thing at the top here and just blend out the concealer. You can also use foundation at the top of your brow as well. Um, especially if you're just going for a more natural look, you can use foundation. I'm just blending out any lines. Just 
softening it up. And then what I do afterwards, because my eyebrows are thinner, is I take the mascara brush one more time and brush it up. And then I brush it forward. Then I take a beauty blender and I continue to blend it in, blend all the concealer in around. That gives it a more natural look. Instead of it being so dark on my eyebrows or the um, pencil being so dark on my eyebrows. There is one brow. And it just makes it look like I have some hair there. Look at this one versus this one. Now this one, I'm gonna show you how to do it with eyeshadow. All right, now I'm gonna teach you how to do it with an eyeshadow. You can use, like if you don't have a brown um, pencil or just really don't know how to draw it in, you can also use eyeshadow. So I'm gonna use this dark brown eyeshadow. I'm going to take it and just put it on my brow. But first, I'm going to brush my brows up. So I'm going to brush them up and just brush them over so that all the hair stay in place. And I'm going to take my brown shadow. I'm just going to put it all on the brow just kind of fill it in. This is also a very easy way to um, do your brows. Now I'm gonna take my concealer because the concealer is what's, what does the shaping. So I'm gonna take my concealer and just go right on up under and shape my brows shape at the bottom and I'm going to shape at the top. Um, I'm going to show you how to shape at the top using your foundation. So I'm just wipe this part off. So I'm going to take my foundation at the top and I'm going to take um, an angle brush or a detailer brush like this. Don't forget to use to the back of your hand as a palette so that you do not apply too much. You're just going to follow that line and you're just going to shape. Ooh. And it's okay if you mess up because you're learning and we're learning together and practice makes perfect. So. Take that. Do it like that. All right, so I got my foundation at the top. I'm gonna start at the bottom where I put the concealer. And remember that the concealer or the foundation, it does the shape of y'all. So, but it makes it easier if your eyebrows already have a shape too, or some type of shape. Um, but as you can see in my case, because my eyebrows are thinner, I don't have no type of shape. So, so I'm just going to go ahead on and blend it out. Blend it out at the top. I'm using circular motions to go ahead and blend it out. Don't forget the circular motions as we learned in the previous videos, okay? Yeah. There's that. And I'm just gonna brush the product in a little bit more. So, use the, using um, a mascara brush, I'm just gonna take this and brush it in just a little bit more just to give it a natural effect. And I'm gonna take my Beauty Blender and blend out all the makeup. 
Now, not everybody does this, but I do because my eyebrows are thinner and I like them to look more natural. I don't like them to look, um, you know, heavy or too dark or anything like that. So it looks more like a natural brow. And this one is gonna be a little lighter because I used a dark brown and not a black. And I might just add, if you like me and you really like, you just add a little bit more of your shadow. And like I said, I use a dark brown shadow on this side versus this side. <clears throat> is how you do your eyebrows um those are two ways you can do it this is on thinner eyebrows in the next clip there will be a way to do it on a thicker brow or if you have more full fuller brows um there is a way to do it with my guest Michaela. so first we're going to start with um Michaela. we're going to do one eyebrow and then i'm going to have her do her own on the other one okay so we already washed and primed her face. Um, washed, moisturized, honed, and primed. And we're gonna have you turn that way so that everybody can see. All right, we're going, so her eyebrows are full and thick. And the first thing you wanna do is kind of shape them up. So she's already been shaped somewhat. <clears throat> so here we're gonna get started. We're going to brush her eyebrows up. And then we want to brush them over to get all the hairs in place. Like that. Let's do that light. All right, so we're gonna brush her eyebrow up and over. And then I'm just going to fill it in where she kind of, we can add a little bit more here just to darken them up. She doesn't need much because she has plenty of eyebrow. So you're really just brushing it and then we're gonna shape it. So I'm brushing in the product, brushing it over. And now we're gonna take our concealer to shape it. This is Kyle's concealer. And wipe it a little bit on the back of my hand and I'm going to take my angled brush and I'm going to shape her brows so I'm going to start at the bottom I'm going to use small strokes and just follow the brow shape So we got the bottom. And then we're gonna take a blending brush. We'll take a smaller type of blending brush and blend her out at the bottom. So here's my small type of blending brush. I'm just gonna use circular motions to shape her to blend it out all right <clears throat> oh, that way there we go all right got the bottom taken care of now we're going to do the top and just use small strokes that way you're not applying too much and it won't smear your concealer won't smear into your eyebrows And we 
are going to use our blending brush again and we're going to buff it out. So we're going to start at the top where the line is. You're going to buff that out. And you're going to buff this part up. Where your eyebrow is, you're going to buff it up into your forehead. And kind of spread the product around. I'm using a circular motion. Now we're going to take a beauty blender and we're going to blend it until it looks natural. I'm getting sleepy in this eye. And close your eye and blend the bottom as well. And it's going to blend it until it looks natural. And there we have a nice shaped brow. Yeah. Okay. Let's see if I can get this one. Let's see if she can do it on her own on the other side. <laughs> How can I make help you on your makeup journey? Click the link below to book a call with me today and we can chit chat how I can help you. Thank you for watching and please like and subscribe for more videos each week.